This single drop of water might be thousands of years old. It may have been pumped from deep underground where it's been trapped for the past 5,000 years. Before that, it may have once been a drop in an ancient sea. Later, it may have existed as an ice crystal in a glacier or been part of a cloud high in the sky. How does water change from one form to another? The answer lies in something called the water cycle. The water cycle is the continual movement of water from sources of liquid water to the air and then back to Earth. The water cycle is going on constantly all around us, even though we may not realize it. There are three very important processes at work in the water cycle. Evaporation, condensation, and precipitation. Let's take a closer look at the water cycle and see just how water changes from one form to another.